addicted, a faith-based rehab center becomes one of the first to combine its Christ-centered program with medicine to gain a state license. S2L, as it's called, S2L Recovery, is one of only a handful of these centers in the country centered around Christ, but also one that has the necessary medical personnel to treat addiction. Fox 17 News Kathleen Jacob live in studio to tell us what sets these guys apart? Yeah, so you have a lot of rehab centers that offer religious tracks, but rarely do you find one where the entire program centers around Christ. They've been around for 14 years, but just one week ago, they became one of the only programs of its kind to get licensed by the state. They're able to accept insurance. Ryan Chittister says it's truly a miracle of God that he's here today. I overdosed on heroin in a buddy's backyard um, and his my buddy's mom and his father came outside and started to pray over my body. Um, and after about five minutes, um, she said I came back to it. Days later, he checked into S2L Recovery, a faith-based rehab in Woodbury, Tennessee. My life has been radically changed in every way possible. A hard process, but one that's transformed him into someone free from addiction and now serving others. It is the most gratification you could ever get in life to see a man come from the depths of darkness and despair and destruction and within a week two three weeks just seeing that man full of hope full of joy full of peace full of comfort ceo and pastor at s2l recovery adam comer says now they'll be able to grow and serve even more people thanks to being granted state licensure we've been a ministry for 14 years and we've always thought and been told that this is impossible uh, but it happened. Happened because they did a unique thing, combining faith and the science it takes to get recognized by the state and be able to accept insurance. You have to be able to not throw out one or the other. Dr. Andrew Daigle is the medical director at S2L Recovery. He was drawn to it because he wanted to help patients as a whole. And for him, that includes the soul. Because we're addressing a suffering person. And, how, and what's the answer to your suffering? is an understanding of your identity, especially your identity in Christ. And it's that whole being recovery that these men believe could change the course of the opioid epidemic. There's hope inside of this. I know it looks very dark and gloomy, but there is hope. Hope for recovery in the body and the soul. S2L Recovery only serves men. However, you do not have to be a Christian to go there. They say they won't change their teachings, but they do welcome everyone. For more information, there's a link on our website, fox17.com. In studio, Kathleen Jacob, Fox 17 News, your Code Red Station.